What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So we're seeing the fact that I managed to uh, get a diamond bang tang with the AR-300 and took down two diamond fallow with the 4570. I haven't uh, done much uh, bird hunting so I decided to hop on Revan Tully Coast. I brought out the 10 gauge, bought a couple of rounds for the bird shot. I also brought the 12 gauge pump as well. But uh, here at my first location, I got a setup here for uh, gray lag goose. I'm going to send out a few calls and uh, hopefully uh, get something decent. Well, it wasn't long, and I'm not too sure if you guys actually got a glimpse of that, but uh, for a gray like goose, I actually got a level 5. Where is he? Come on, fly over. Actually, you know what? I'm going to continue calling you guys in. Now, I think this uh, has been updated, because I don't remember the gray like goose caller sounding like this. I could be mistaken, but uh, you guys can let me know in the comments. But yet again, it's been so long I haven't gone after any of the bird species. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Now, I'm not too sure if he's actually diamond potential. Oh, are you flying away? And that's definitely the wrong call. That's not good that he's uh, actually leaving. Yeah, he went into defense mode. Hopefully he comes back. Now I have a flock that came in. Now I moved my layout blind here. I think it was too close. But I do have a few. That was a miss. Not too sure how many I actually got there. Probably just the one. It was a level 3 male, got a flesh, 21 yards, let's just uh, check here, but I, like I said I'm pretty sure I didn't get the 1, and uh, hopefully that level 5 does come back. I believe I got 3 grey lag goose coming in here about the land, although I didn't uh, see anything special, so I'm going to bring out the 12 gauge. Let's uh, maybe uh, send out another call here. They're definitely getting lower. And it looks like they are coming in for the landing here. There was one male, but I believe it was only a level one. I'm gonna wait till they all land. There's a male. And they're getting out there. That was a bunch of shells wasted, but I did get one, which is the, the male. And here he is. Did get a little bit of penetration there at uh, 49 yards. It's a surprise, I finally got another one to float to me. I think this was from before. Uh, two on a female. And I did get a bunch of them land over here. Oh wow, perfect. I think that's three. Although I do find the 10 gauge slacking a few shells. If it had six, definitely it would be overpowered a bit. Uh, I got a f two minor female. A w level one female. And this should be the last one up here. Yeah, this one was trying to get away. Another two minor female. Now, when I first started, I started at 5 o'clock in the morning. If I want to try to get that level 5 to come in, maybe I'm going to end up backing up the time. But I'm going to continue and see how it goes. Alright guys, this may be my second opportunity. I did back up the time. There's The level 5 is actually in the front. 
Now hopefully he actually lands. And make sure I actually grab the right shotgun. Come on, buddy. Now I'm not too sure if the, the bird species actually pick up your scent, because I know a lot of the times when the wind's blowing towards them, they still get alert even though you're in your blind. And the fact that I was so close to the decoys before, that might have uh, set them off as well. Is that him? No, that's not him. There he is. Still calm. Please don't land in the water so far out. Oh, he's coming in for the landing. That should be him on the left. Is that him? It's definitely him. Did I just smoke him? Oh my, I smoked him. Now we play the waiting game, and I really hope he is a diamond. Alright, here he is, the moment of truth. Let's go ahead and claim him. Oh my, he is a diamond. I got him in the skull at 85 yards. Oh uh, yeah, let's definitely save harvest. What do you need for a diamond? Now he's scoring four right on the dot. So you need a 3.85 for a diamond, and he's giving me a score of four. Now, I have seen this guy in the past, I'd probably say about a year ago, but I never got an opportunity to take him down and I just pulled it off. So now I officially have completed diamonds with the new weapon pack. Like I mentioned before, the AR-300 was a bang tang. After that I went out to Fallow, I took down two diamonds with a 4570, and I just took down a diamond gray light goose with the tang gauge, semi-auto. Well, I did have a few that came in. Got a little four. Not too sure exactly how many I got, but uh, let's go and claim them. This guy was a level four, I do believe. All right, so he's giving me a score of 355, and what do you need again? 3.85. That's still a decent gold, I would say. This one, I'm not too sure what it was. Uh, only a level one female. So, seeing the fact that I just got my diamond gray light goose, I decided to go after another species, which is going to be the Eurasian teal. Although, for these guys, I have no like idea if I do have any good sized ones, but I'm gonna go ahead and take this guy down. And I'm gonna say those shots missed. Definitely got two of them. Here's one. This is a light green. Two minor male. Uh, where's the other one? There should... Oh, it floated to my, uh... Layout blind here. This one's a brown. This was a level one female. It hasn't been going the greatest, but I got two females here. I think I'm just gonna... Pop them here with the 12 gauge. Uh, she's gonna get away. Actually not. Gonna wait till this one, uh... This one's almost here. Got a flesh at 25 yards. And here's the other one that almost got away. Let's go ahead and claim it. Uh, another flesh at 81 yards. And teal wasn't really going the greatest. I decided to come back to uh, my location for the gray light goose. Now I actually got uh, quite the flock that came in here. Question is, are they gonna, all going to land?
Now the biggest one I actually did spot out was a level 3. I may have a couple. These guys coming? Oh, they're already landing. Come on, I would like more to land. Looks like they're all going to land around here. the 12 gauge uh, they're definitely out of range gonna see about this one here like I said for the 10 gauge I do find it's kind of lacking a few shells Uh, this was a two minor male. I do have a loner, and it's only a female. Let's just take her down with a 12 gauge. Guess it would definitely help if I actually uh, connected the shot on her. Now, I did actually notice, I think I had another one actually pile up in the water, and when I checked it out, it was like 300 yards out. Uh, two minor female. Well, let's actually get out of the blind here. Looks like I said, I did see one. Oh, it finally made it over here. So let's see what this one was from the last flock. Okay, this was a level three male. Got a flesh at 56. Flock. Biggest one yet is a level four. Maybe I should have kept eyes on him. That's definitely not him. Where did he go? Wait, is that him there? Yeah, that's him there. Alright, let's keep him occupied here with a collar. By the looks of it, he is taking the bait. And hopefully comes in for the landing, which I think he's about to do. That one's hit. Okay, that's a female. I really hope I did connect with that level 4. Not sure if this is him or not. In fact, it is. Oh, that, I'm going to definitely take a screenshot of that. Look, that looks amazing. Got him at 32 yards. Not too sure how well this is going to go. They all landed over by the decoys. I did have some level 3s. I had at least two level 3 females and a level 3 male, which, I, like I said, I don't think I'm going to be able to get on them. Uh, let's try the 12 gauge. Not sure if I'm actually hitting anything. Oh, that's definitely out of range. I'm gonna go over there and see, but I don't think I actually hit anything. I have one piled up here. Uh, two minor female. Got the upper neck at 63 yards. That was with the 12 gauge. I do see some blood here. Although I'm not a big fan of tracking down the birds, that's for sure. Well, one thing I actually didn't think about for the this kind of situation and is actually to bring out the retriever. Um, it's not the one I was actually tracking, but I did find this one. This was a level 3 male. Got a flesh at 71 yards. Now, the other one I have no idea where it is, but I don't think it was anything special anyways. Well, folks, the video is coming shortly to an end, so I already went ahead and uh, placed him in the lodge. I think he actually looks good in that position. So, yeah, very uh, happy that I uh, decided to uh, hop on Reverend Tooley Coast and uh, got him down. Like I've said, um, I have seen him before, 
although I didn't really uh, try to really focus and try to get them but uh, today I managed to pull it off and like I said all new weapons that uh, just recently came out I've taken down diamonds with it so uh, I'm very uh, pleased with that so like I said that's gonna be a wrap for the clip for those that watch my videos I really appreciate it like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys all next time Thank <laughs> you.